Last year's Elantra Sport sedan generated more than a little heat among enthusiasts for its winning combination of capable handling and a lively drivetrain, and at first glance, the 2018 Hyundai Elantra GT Sport would seem to offer more of the same, albeit in hatchback form. Once again, however, it's important to remember that the GT is an Elantra in name only, and given that it was developed for the European market first and then imported to North America with only a few changes, it's clear within the first few miles that the car's cornering chops aren't quite as focused as it's those of its sport sedan counterpart. This is also the case for its 1.6-liter turbo drivetrain, which pulls strong but doesn't deliver the pop and burble thrills found in the sedan as a result of the latter's more aggressive tuning. This is not to say that the Elantra GT Sport isn't a worthwhile upgrade over the 2.0-liter model, especially if you crave the gutsier acceleration of its turbocharged engine. Still, what was most noticeable in driving the two cars back to back on the same twisting back roads in Quebec's Laurentians was better body control, thanks to the presence of a rear sway bar, at the expense of a somewhat harsher ride, with 12% stiffer springs up front and 22% stiffer coils in the rear. The Sport also benefits from a true independent rear suspension versus the torsion bar in the regular GT but I was hard-pressed to find a situation where that detail made a significant difference in handling. Regardless of trim level, the 2018 Hyundai Elantra GT looks sharp inside and out with its larger honeycomb grille, LED run.